Yeah, yeah, we came out swinging the first game. I think we put up six or seven early and um, got a good effort from Bonet, and then the bullpen came in. Moreno, I think, threw three or four innings uh, following a little injury with Bonet. So uh, very pleased with game one. You know, game two and game three just didn't go our way. You know, it's one of those things. You know, on the road, you you got to take advantage of opportunities you have, and, and you know, because you're not going to get a lot of opportunities on the road. And we just didn't take advantage of them, and they they did a good job. They hit. I was telling Coach Latore, they, they Dominguez Hills does a great job of hitting mistakes. We left some balls up, and they uh, they crushed them. Took advantage of the situation. <laughs> Absolutely. I came from uh, Cal State Fullerton in the winter. Uh, was told I wasn't really going to play much there. Got an opportunity to call Coach. Uh, Stefano talked to him and he offered me to come and play and you know that's what I wanted to do is play baseball this year uh, after having to sit out last year and uh, watching a great program at Cal State Fullerton and got to learn a lot and I think I brought that here to this program and uh, you know we're starting off uh, eight and eight which is you know not what we wanted uh, but uh, I believe that we're gonna uh, figure it out as the season comes and right now um, I think that we're playing a uh, with the level of a team, the, the other team. I mean, we played at Cal Poly, one of the best D2 schools, and we played with them. I mean, I believe that weekend we could have beat anybody. Uh, doing much, I mean, watching Cal Poly, I feel like we were playing D1 with those arms and that team. And, uh, you know, then going down to play, you know, different schools, you can see the difference in pitching. I feel like that's it. I mean, I feel like we have, some of our guys have D1 uh, ability with the bat and uh, some arms and, uh, I feel like we are a really good team. We just needed to start clicking, and we could, I mean, we could play D1. I'm sure we could beat out there and play, beat some of those teams. Uh, we just have to have the, the mentality to go out and win games and know we're the best out there. Yeah, just looking at the stats, um, recognize some names from the recruiting <laughs> the last few years up at when I was at Davis, and uh, um, Coach Ralston's done a great job building that program the last three, four years. Uh, they, they're hitting 340 as a team. Um, so we have we have our work <laughs> cut out for us on the mound, but uh, you know it's like anything. I, I say I think I feel like I say it each week. Yes, yeah. we, we're not playing against the opponent. We're playing against the baseball, and if we do our job and execute on on offense and throw strike one and play catch, we'll, we'll, we'll have a good opportunity to win. Um, actually, I was gone recruiting yesterday, so Coach <laughs> Tory had the duties yesterday. But uh, um, he said it was a great practice, good intensity, and, and and we don't lack the intensity at all in practice and, and the focus at all in, in practice. Uh, our practices are usually at this time of year more centered around, you know, something that maybe the other team does really well. If it's a team that short games or skills, we're going to practice our bunt defense that week. Or if the previous weekend we we messed up on a couple pop up priorities, we're definitely doing pop up priority <laughs> on Tuesday and Wednesday. So it's things like that. We get our swings in, we get our PFPs in, uh, pitchers get their bullpens in based on their when they're going to pitch on the weekend. Now it is it is up in the air a little bit with the rain coming in. Mm -hmm. So. Uh, um, today we're going to scrimmage. Some guys that didn't travel are going to throw in a scrimmage today for about seven, eight innings, mm -hmm. and uh, our batters will get some live at bats.